Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about adding and subtracting positive and negative numbers, and we want to evaluate each expression. So if I was given this expression, negative 27 minus 24, okay? Well, if I have negative 27 minus 24, um, I can rewrite this minus to be adding a negative. So I can rewrite this to be negative 27 plus a negative 24. Now notice that. We have subtraction turning into adding a negative. Same thing. And the reason why I did that is because my first number was already negative. So now I have two negative numbers I need to add together. Well, if I add two negative numbers, it's just going to be very similar as to if I added two positive numbers. Just the result at the end is going to be negative. So if I have negative 27 plus a negative 24, we're moving in the negative direction together here. Well, 7 plus 4 is 1. We carry the 1, or in this case, negative 1, right? Uh, <laughs> well, 2, 2, 1, add them together is 5, and we have a negative 51. Now, this is tricky. You might think, you know, really, this is like negative 7 plus a negative 4 is a negative 1, right? But our final answer, we want to think about, is has to be negative. It's going to be a more negative number than the other two. If I have two negative numbers and I add them together, they're going more towards that negative direction. So, again, let's start from the beginning. We have negative 27 minus 24. Subtraction is the same thing as adding a negative. So we have negative 27 plus a negative 24. And then we combine those, we add them together. Negative 27 plus a negative 24. 7 plus 4 is 1. Carry the 1, right? It's 11. Uh, carry the 1. And then 1, 2, and 2 is 5. So we have negative 51 as our final answer. 